I bet you've heard a story about a young mom or a grandma who lifted a car. I'm talking about a real automobile because their child, their grandchild, was caught under it and they had to get the child out to save the person's life. Well, how does that happen? You're as strong as you think yourself to be. You know, Abraham Lincoln said, you're as happy as you think yourself to be. But it isn't just about happiness. It's about every area of your life. Now, recently, I needed to take care of some things in my house. And I wasn't able to reach the strong young man who normally helps me with stuff like that. So I had to do a couple of things, like moving my dresser. It's a very large mahogany dresser, jam-packed full of stuff and I needed to move it. And a few weeks ago when I tried, it was like, this isn't gonna happen, it's not gonna budge. But the other day I said, I need to move it, I need to move it now, and I did. And today I was taking care of emptying my earth boxes because the winter's coming on fast and I need to empty them. Now where I live, we get lots and lots and lots of rain. So it wasn't just that they were filled with dirt, they were filled with wet dirt. And I had to move them quite a distance to be able to empty them. And I did, I needed to, so I did. So what is it that you don't think you're strong enough to do in your life? Maybe it's not something physical. Maybe it's an emotional situation you need to handle. The thing is, if you know in your heart that you can do it, you can. I'm Allie Beerman, and you'll find me over at yourrelationshipintelligence.com. Everything in your life, every good thing, every bad thing gets registered. And when you have a disconnect between you and your own spirit, between you and your higher self, between you and other people, between you and a higher power. Every incident that falls into any of those categories impacts your body, mind, and spirit. Come on over and find out how you can grow your relationship in intelligence now.